Well, that breaking news, three people are dead after a powerful explosion. That video you just saw was the moment an auto body shop went up in flames. Thanks for joining us at 10. I'm Chris Jacobs. It all happened in Highland County at Jimbo's Auto Repair in Hillsboro on the corner of High Street and Belfast Road. That's where we find WLWT News 5's Rachel Hersheimer live at the scene. And Rachel, what exactly can you tell us about the situation? Well, Chris, this used to be a really well known auto body shop. Now it is completely leveled after a massive explosion killed three people and injured one person. The fire chief tells me he was able to feel the ground shake from blocks away. A deadly explosion rocking a community. It literally looked like a, a bomb went off in it. Jimbo's auto repair shop in Hillsboro is now destroyed after something sparked an explosion with people inside. Thick black smoke could be seen for miles. Oh my goodness, you could you wouldn't recognize it. It's like a two and a half, three car garage. And I bet you could put all the back of it in a dump truck now, unfortunately. Fire crews were called just after four this afternoon. It definitely did rock the and shake the, the area. Fire Chief David Manning says four people were inside when something sparked this explosion, causing the ground to shake. One person was taken to the hospital and is stable. Three others were killed. At the firehouse, which is about four or five blocks away, uh, we could fill it at the firehouse. Richard Brown brings his car to Jimbo's for repairs and is close with the employees. And I hurried on home because I know just about everybody that lives there. Jimbo, who owns the place, really stand up guy, first rate mechanic. You know, he'll work with people. His mother, you know, works here at the business with him. He's got, you know, young guys that work here, know their thing, and I know a couple of them. As the scene continues to burn, this tight knit community is just beginning to mourn. People just going about their day, and this is what happens. And you're taking a live look at the building still smoldering at this hour. The fire chief believes the three people who were killed worked inside this building. And now the fire marshal's office is investigating what exactly happened tonight inside. Live tonight in Hillsboro, Rachel Hersheimer, WWT News 5. Yeah, Rachel, just a tragic and terrifying situation as well. Do we have any idea what exactly caused the explosion? Well, Chris, I actually asked the fire chief during the press conference if this explosion was suspicious at all. He said the fire marshal's office is investigating all of those details. He didn't know at this moment. So any questions we have going farther in this investigation, you have to ask the fire marshal's office. Chris. All right, Rachel, thank you so much. Leading the way.